are then round number three race number five of the MVP race in BGWT uh, 15 minute sprint race at Spa I'm not going to go for the quick so I want to try and get a sprint and a feature into one video uh, so I've got just under 55 minutes to do both uh, so let's see if I could do it with the editing software as well but uh, West on pole position let me get this information up for a minute so West gets them underway heading down to the source for the first time um, yeah perfect start there from uh, from West but Ingerholm's looking around the outside there of West but he doesn't do it no El Esteno KB runs it very wide off the track and Dave uh, yes yeah, so I remember Dave saying something about this where is where's he gone where's where's he gone so you got it all wrong on the exit I think he just hit the um, to be honest with you he hit the I know people don't like this camera view but they were just looking I think he hit the the yellow sausage Kirby yeah hit that spun him out now he's got it all to do he's got to recover he's down in 50 position but yeah round three already uh, race number five spa Franklin shops Inca Holmes in the lead uh, so already he's, he's took the lead from West which is very surprising but with the slipstream effect we've got LS Tano there just giving West a bit of a nudge got KB to the right as well so Inca Holmes losing three positions there in one in one go but they're three wide now heading down to this turn here Darren get your get your brain working what's going on with your brain they action packed this race to be honest with you um, I did make an appearance for this round uh, and the feature race as well quite enjoyed it quite enjoyed it uh, but they're in a different level to me and not quite up to their, their speed at the minute but West in second KB in third but Deno up to lead Ico Pants in fourth Ico Holmes in fifth so clinical clinical or clinical yeah uh, I'm gonna call you let's call you clinical yeah uh, clinical I think that's what it is oh, my, my name pronunciation ain't the best I do apologize TKM Spanners in 7th, Valtteri in that 8th, harassing the rear of TKM Spanners. Spanners wasn't happy with his um, with his qualification, uh, where he came in qualification, uh, but he's slowly making his way out with Lee Fitz in 9th, Marshall in 10th, Adam in 11th. Yeah, that's me, you're freaking, what are you doing in there? Yeah, that's, that's me in 12th, that's what, to give it a go, race with the boys, do commentary for him. Just jump in, the real Osman making his debut in this season. He's in 13, Crowcrown in 14, and Dave's still recovering in that 15 position, but leading the way still, LS Steno. Big, breaking a little bit of a gap now to KB behind him. Uh, sorry, West behind him. KB's in that third position. They're slowly followed by Ickle Pants, Mark. So, Mark in his prime opportunity now. Just a uh, Ickle Holmes looking to the inside there at the bus stop. Is he? He thought about it, but he uh, backed out of it. Mark, if he can just play it right, just sit behind KB and maybe get a little bit of a gap between him and Inca Holmes. But so, gonna call there down the the outside by the looks of it onto Inca Holmes. Does he make this move stick? No, maybe looking for the switch back there. Oh, thought about it, but did he actually do it? No, he didn't do it. But TKM and Spanners up to seven. We've got a group of cars behind battling. Bow Terry. Uh, Valtteri, why are you showing down to 15 when you're not your yeah, yeah, 8th or is that just my eyesight? So Valtteri, the lead runner from the real Osman, from Marshall, from Lee Fitzy. And yeah, we've got the real Osman looking to the outside. No, he does not. The real Osman just sitting in behind Valtteri, but he switches it to the inside. Oh, it's all going off. Got Lee Fitzy as well. Got Adam, got myself. We've got Dave rec doing a recovery driving. The side by side. No. Craig just backed out of it uh, but Marshall looking for a way through as well so Marshall looking for night position off of the real Osman can he get that move done but behind him he's got Lee Fitz and Adam batting it side by side uh, drop it down to the sweeping right hand now I can't remember the corner name so do forgive me um, yeah, just trying to get this video done into one shot with the sprint and the feature I hope it works I do hope it works so Adam Lee Fitz myself uh, coming to Passion Alpha, Crowcrow, Crowcrow looking to the inside there of me. Does he get his move done? I can't quite remember. Um, no, he does not. I hang up around the outside. I'm still around the outside of Crowcrow. Am I still around the outside? I'm around the outside. But anyway, Fat Pickles all day still recovering. Up the front we go. It's all about the battle at the front in a minute. West now retakes the lead off of Ellis. Can we pick that up? No, it's already done. 
Oh, oh sorry, I've missed that. I do apologise for Elisteno. In comes Elisteno now. He's been pressured by his teammate. What can his teammate do? We look to the inside. No, he does not. He's still behind. <coughs> <coughs> oh, God, sorry. Still behind Elisteno. So KB helping his teammate as well. From KB's perspective, in car with KB helping his teammates to try and close the gap to West up ahead. But Mark is just benefiting from that slip stream from KB. And they're already gapping. So we've got a top four already breaking away. Bit of a gap to TKM Spadders. Uh, but TKM Spadders is battling it away with um, with Inca Holmes. Inca Holmes around the outside. TKM Spadders in the inside. Does he get his move done? Uh, he does not. TKM Spadders retakes that fifth position. But Inca Holmes, he's there. You know, he's in that he's in that uh, prime position to get the, the slip stream. So clinical there um, in that seventh position. Breaking a bit of a gap down to the real Osmond. So the real Osmond managed to get through. And form a bit of a gap now between himself and Adam. Adam up to ninth position. Uh, Valtteri, Valtteri seemed to struggle, but a bit of lag there from Adam. Jumping a little bit. I didn't see that in the race. So Valtteri, the lead runner for 10th, 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th. And the man in 15th place is slowly, slowly catching up to Rear and me. Um, yeah, we'll come back to this in a minute. I, will, I do like Spa, but I struggled that evening. I don't know what was going on, but I do appreciate that you know them allowing me to race KB now. So LS Deno's falling down to fourth position. What's going on with LS Deno? So he's in the slipstream of West. What happened at the top? Was it just oh almost lost it? Wow, LS Deno almost had a massive moment there. Top of um uh, what's this? O Rouge? Yeah, O Rouge down. Yes, it's O Rouge. At the top, just hit that green astro turf. The rear end of the car started dancing around like it's at a nightclub, but yeah, KB goes through, Ickle Pants goes through as well, so Dano down to four. What can he do? Lap number three, 15 minutes sprint race, race is off. Uh, there is no fuel depletion, there's no tire wear on, nothing like that. That will be the feature race. Uh, Tico and Spanners being passed now from Inca Home, so these two having their own little battle. Ideally, what you want to do is work together, um, try and help each other out. So you close the gap up to the top four. Um, but at this moment in time, they are battling for position. Uh, so Kinnacle there in seventh. Is he capitalising from these two battling away? So, so Kinnacle there. Yeah, he's gaining a few temps here and there to the back of TKM Spadders. So I think by these fighting, what has gone on there? Mark, 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 Mark. Has Mark had an issue? They're side by side battling. He's battling away with LS Deno. Did you get it wrong on the exit? Oh, almost lost that rear end of that car. Mark into the barrier. So he's got it all to do. So he is recovering now. Damage. Damage is minimal. Damage is light, I think, in this, this league. I can't remember. My mind's everywhere. But yeah, damage must be light. So he hasn't picked up no major, major damage. So he can just compose himself and get back up there. But then again, he's got to wait. Uh, you know, he's got, he's got Inca Holmes and TKM Spadders closing that gap to him. Uh, TKM Spadders looking to hang it around the outside, as you know, just backs out of it. So Inca Pants in fourth may come under pressure from fifth and sixth anytime soon. So let's go out. Let's go down and see what else is going on. So Clinical now being caught by the real Osman, the real Osman in a position. Remember, this is his is debut in the MVP BGWT um, season 12. So let's see how he gets on this season. Uh, Adam in that night. So real Osman still looking for that move onto So Clinical. Can he get this move done, or will So Clinical just defend seven minutes in, around about eight minutes to go of the sprint race? Uh, if you do like the video, please do like, comment, subscribe. It does help me and helps MVP. I'm trying to get my subscriptions a little bit higher. Uh, so it will be appreciated. Thank you. Uh, so no, Real Osman hasn't got that move done. Uh, so he's still he's still waiting for that opportunity. Adam in night. Valtteri. Valtteri in that 10th position. And here we are. We've got this group forming now. Uh, Dave has caught up. So from Dave's perspective, in car with Dave now. He is behind Crow Crowd, heading up to the source now. Um, me and Marshall side by side. I think with this car, it's more about the gearing. Uh, it's about getting the gearing spot on. I, I found with the, you know, so I'm using this car in another league as well. So the gearing for me, I could just work it out. But at Sardegna, the next track, I managed to get it spot on and I was quite happy with the, the car. So yeah. Dave up to 14, Crocard down to 15, myself 13, Marshall 12, 
Marshall now in car with Marshall. He's spatting side by side there with with um, Valtteri. And can Marshall get this move done onto Valtteri? He can indeed. I'm looking around the inside of Valtteri as well. I give him a little bit of a knock, so I back off. I do apologise, but yes, yeah, spark on that car. As I said in a previous video, please do check them out. Now, from that, I've lost quite a few positions. Well, two, and I'm down to 14. By me backing off, which is right, I hit into Valtteri. You know, I just uh, eased off and just let him go on um, and try and, you know, compose himself and crack on with the race. So, yeah, Crow Crown in 15th position. But battles this moment in time is between the top three. So, LS Steno West. So in Carl West now, he's, he's in a bit of a sandwich now. Uh, he's like the ham and the um, the butter. And these two are the, the bread, you know, they're the top and bottom. They had a nice thick, thick crust at the top, you know, the top of the bread. And then you get the thick at the bottom as well. Um, ignore the middle bits, just, you know, put it in the toaster. Loads of butter, loads of Marmite. Num, 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 num. I wonder if they'll ever make a Marmite cake. That's all I want to know. Uh, so here we are, Wes in the slipstream of KB. He's looking for P number one here. Oh. And will he get it, oh? I don't know. We will try wait and see. LS done a very late break in there to the inside of Wes. Bloody Laura, where did you come from, LS Dello? Yes, very late on their breaks. Let's go back and have a look at our guess. So LS Dello's like, yes, oh, yes. I'm just going along the road like a double driver. Boom. See that opportunity, broke way later, seen the gap on the inside and went for it. Uh, but West back in the inside, so yeah, I'm having it back, my friend, whether you'd like it or not. So again, Ica Holmes in fourth, we've got TKM Spatters in that fifth position. He's looking for the move onto Ica Holmes. They've been battling for a few laps and they're gaining up a little bit too to the back of LS Dello. Maybe Adams worked out, but right, you know, we've got to work together to close the gap and by the looks of it, 100% they have a mark um, as is in sip and he's got to try and recover as well if he can. Um, there's enough of a ground between him and so Kinnacle in that 7th position so he hasn't got to worry about 7th place. Just focus, head down, get up there if you can. So Kinnacle in that 7th, Adam in 8th, Lee Fitzy in ninth. Come to Adam, come under pressure now from Lee Fitzy. So Lee Fitzy in that ninth position in the slipstream there of Adam. And behind we've got Marshall as well in that temp. So, yeah, Lee Fitzy looking the long way round onto Adam. Will he get his move done? See Adam in the ring mirror any time soon. There's Adam in the rear view mirror. And yes, Lee Fitzy does get that move done. He's up to eight. Adam in ninth. Marshall in ten. Bit of ground now to his teammate. But we're battling now for position. So, Valtteri in the middle again. Fat Pickles throwing myself behind the Will Osman. Had a massive moment. He did lose it. It's a previous slap. He did lose it. So, he lost a bit of ground. So he was trying to recover as well, but Valtteri, Valtteri as well in that 12 position, just under around about three minutes to go, or four minutes. Gosh, you know, you can tell I'm not with it at this moment in time. So the idea is, is to get, to get the sprint and the feature done in one video. Uh, so it saves me like editing like two. So if I can record this, and once the race ends, I go back on to the, the feature race and I'll record that then I'll go into the editing software and combine the two so so it'll probably make a good video but we'll wait and see so it's trial and error but it's something else I want to do you know and I think hopefully it will work gaps appearing now so yeah the closest battle on track I can tell this moment in time um, is KB and LS Steno and West for the win uh, these three been battling non-stop ever since. Yeah, TK and Spatters now, because Ink Holmes had a bit of an error and a bit of a moment, so he's looking to recover, but he has got his teammate behind, and that's enabled Mark to get up to that fifth. So, so clinical in sip, gaining position, Lee Fitzy, Adam, Adam as well to the rear. He can quite possibly get two for the price of one, will he? That's the thing. Uh, and then we've got Marshall in 10th. We've got Fat Biggles in 11th. Valtteri in 12th. Myself in 13th. Real Osman in 14th. And then Crocrad to the rear in 15th position. Uh, penultimate lap of the race. Good race. Good race. I enjoyed it. Even though I was like, you know, like dead last. I still enjoy it. So KB, um, head on to penultimate lap. He's, um, yeah, unstoppable in this race. But with that slipstream effect as well, Elisteno is looking for the win. 
He's looking there to the inside of KB. He does get that move done. The fast lap of the race so far is LS Dano 2.24084. Time gap there uh, in the, the ready pinky sort of colour. So further down we go. I mean, the rear runners are so, so far behind. It wasn't a massive gap, but it was enough. Uh, so LS Deno in that first position. Then we got further down we go. I think this is when Valto has some sort of issue. Um, if I remember, he ran it a little bit wide. Let's go on board with Valto now because the two teammates up ahead, Marshall and Fat Bulls Road, they were battling. Uh, myself is behind the real Osman coming under pressure now from from Crowcrow. So Crowcrow looking for that 14 off of the real Osman. Uh, Valtteri here. I think this was the moment Valtteri ran it a little bit wide. Yeah, he got onto this this greeny stuff and it tends to push you out. So then he had to try and recover. He fallen right down. Um, well, he lost one actually. I thought he lost more than that, but with his dirty tyres as well. I think that's somewhat put him right down to the rear, I think. I can't remember what actually happened. Um, it was quite a few days ago. But anyway, um, on to which will be uh, the final lap in a moment or two. We've got these two behind battling side by side. Second and third into the bus stop. Ellis then around the outside. Uh, KB to the inside still. So KB still keeps that second position. Ellis then in that third. TK and Spad is in that four position. We'll come back to this in a minute. Let's go have a look further down. Uh, so Valto, yes, he ran it a bit wide. And I think it was into the the final chicane. He, uh, did he misjudge his braking? I can't quite remember. Yes, with dirty tyres, it actually reset him in a bus stop chicane. So this at this point, uh, Valto did finish in that 15th position. You know, dirty tyres, a combination of heavy braking. He slid. I just said we run. So then Valtteri in that 15 position. Valtteri unfortunately finishing last. That's how he gets on in the feet race. So here we are. We've got LS Dano and we got West battling it out. It's going car like this with LS Dano. They're battling for second position. Can West break later? He does not. But a man in the lead. Great battling from the top three. Even the top four before Ickle Pants had that little bit of a moment. But TK and Spadders has recovered well up to that four position. Um, so West now looking for that second, quite possibly first. Let's wait and see. So LS Dano just up, up ahead in front of him, no one behind him. So his concentration now will be on to uh, Mr. Lee Dennington up ahead. But Mr. KB uh, Run to the Hill singer, Mr. X Factor, is yeah, he's uh, he's now gapping his teammate. Seven. You know, he's doing really well. He's, it's just over half a second from, from LS Dano, and he's doing enough. A few attempts here and there, he can break that slipstream. Wait till he gets the next timer, Mark. He may do so, but KB, yeah, fantastic driving from KB. Uh, any sweets in your car, my friend? Any sweets? No, no sweets. Any cakes, actually? Yes, you can see them two badly behind. So, you know, if they carry on doing what they're doing, you know, it's this going to enable KB just to, again, and it, it stayed the same. So LS Deno still in that slip screen. Can he close it uh, to the bus stop? Okay, we'll wait and see. But we're on to the final few corners. But West, West is looking for that second position. Looking to the inside. But LS Deno is defending. KB heading up to the bus stop. Okay, now West looking to go around the long way around. Uh, so LS Deno is defending. Will LS Deno attack first position? He does not. So it looks like the two by bus.com teammates are one and two. Come the end, West in that third position. TK and Spires recovered well up to fourth. Ickle Pants in fifth. Uh, so Kinnacle in sixth. Got it a bit wrong on the final part of the, the, the lap. Adam in seventh. Fat Pigglesbow in eighth. Marshall in ninth. Lee, Lee in um, tenth. I uh, don't know why my car was like that. No idea. Uh -huh. The, the circle button so I'm in 11 real Osman in in 12 crow crowd 13 unfortunately in games towards the, the last bit of the the lap he um he, he had a few moments and unfortunately come in 14 position but that was the the sprint race done uh quickly do the feet race in a minute real Osman crow crowd Inca oh, I'll be back in a minute for 
the main beach race. But well done, KB, Elisteno and Wes. Round six set, sorry, round three, race six of the MVP racing uh, BGWT season 12. Uh, the feature race at Sardegna A. Uh, in this, you will see uh, tire compounds coming into effect. Uh, so you do have to run the soft, the medium and the hard for a minimum of three laps. Fuel and tire wear are on six and two. That's six for the tyres, two for the fuel, so they'll have enough fuel to get to it. And the real Osmond stuck it on pole for the feature race in a moment or two. A few laps in, I will get on to the point situation. The ballast, who's carrying ballast in this round. Ickelpants in second. Um, I'm in fourth, that had a good qualification. Like the top four as well, uh, three as well, four. Well, they all done a good qualification, but some of them were carrying ballast. And for a few, it did have a major effect on them around this track, side by side there with me and Wes. But at the moment, Tyre Osman leading them around for the first time. Chicken Spanners in third, Wes in fourth, myself in uh, fifth, Adam in sixth, Fat Bigglesbro in seventh. Let's see what he can do in this race. Lee Fitz as well, KB drop it down to ninth. Up to 8th now, sorry. Uh, Crocline in 10th. Ella Steno in 11th position. Wasn't happy with the ballast at all. Uh, Barrow in 12th. So Kinnacle in 13th. Incoming Holmes in 14th. And Marshall carrying ballast as well in that 15th position. A long old race. 30 minute race. Uh, remember, you do have to pit three times to change your tyres. More if you choose soft, medium, hard. Uh, minimum of three laps. So while things are still panning out, the point situations moment in time. The Pro Am, Pro Am. Uh, so, Pro Am have the black window sticker, like on the front of the Real Osmonds there, and the Pro will have the white window sticker, but leading away in the Pro is West. Uh, West currently in that fourth position, he has 87 points. Uh, uh, Samuel, who was missing this evening, has 85, but he will be further down going into round number four. KB in third position with 82 points. So KB in third with 82 points. Ella Steno, one point behind his teammate uh, in that fourth position with 81 points. Then we have Ickle Pants, 65 points in fifth position early on in the season. Uh, he had a few not so good results, but he is recovering now. TK and Spanner, 64 points sitting in sip. Uh, Fubuki standing for Valtteri, one round, seven with 26. And then we have uh, Val Terry to the rear in 8th with 26 points as well. Leading the pro am this moment in time is Fat Pickles Bro uh, with 96 points. In 2nd, uh, which I'm... He's doing really well. Marshall with 76 points. Frowny as well in 3rd. He's a uh, proper debut season, but he was missing this evening, so he will drop down. So Frowny is in 3rd uh, with 74 points. Lee Fitzy in 4th with... It's battling here now, Lee Fitzy and Adam. So Lee Fitzy in fourth with 66 points. Then we do have Pilo, um, who missed this round as well with 57 points. And then we have Crocrad um, in sixth with 54 points. Then we have Adam, who I'm on with now, who's the lead runner of this pack in seventh with 46 points. Racing Snake, um, the gentleman that's unfortunately had to retire from the racing with immediate effect racing snake um, you know, he's going to be missed on the track uh, but I hope in time he will come back uh, just like tools doing that as well um, so for me from everyone at MVP uh, we, we do wish you all the best racing snake and I hope in the season or two you're, you're making an appearance a one off appearance but you know everyone's you know accepted your decision to retire with immediate effect and we hope to see you back one day, so yeah, massive respect to you, mate. But, and then, uh, let's go through this in a minute. I'm missing the action. Ella Steno, trying to, trying to recover, but he's not having fun with that ballast at all. Uh, he's currently running in 12th position. In regards to ballast, uh, let's go up to the front. Let's see what's going on. For the real Osman breaking away, 150.035. But we've got Ickle Pants and TK and Spadis batting out for that second and third. But Emin, uh, Samuel was meant to carry maximum ballast, but he missed that evening, 108%. KB uh, is also one of the heaviest on the track, 108%. Ella Steno, who's currently running in 12th, um, has 107 West as well, who's currently running in 4th, 107%. TKM Spadders, 
is currently running third with 106. Fat Pickles, bro, uh, who is currently running here in 10th, has 106. Ickle Pants, um, who's currently running in second, Mark, he has 105. Marshall as well. Marshall, uh, for the first time, he is running Ballast 105%. Frowny, who missed that evening as well. Um, was meant to carry 105% but unfortunately he couldn't as he wasn't here uh, so on lap number 3 Will Osman breaking away remember it's a 30 minute race this race Ickle Pants and Tigem Spadders battling away for that 2nd and 3rd West in 4th, myself in 5th, Lee Fitz in 6th KB in 7th, we have Adam in 8th we've we got Fat Pickles Road, Dave in 9th, Ica Holmes in 10th but Dave is a lead run, I would say Adam is a lead run on his back but in regards to the driver standings, by uh, sorry, the manufacturers, Biopass.com Racing, 174 points. Tick AM in, in second with 136. United Racers in third with 106. We are driven 85. Mass Motorsports 71. LD Motorsports 50. Uh, Digital Car Culture 38. Idle Four Game in 35 points. That's your current standings. Back to the race we go. So already, cars in the pits going to get rid of that racing hard. They've done the free laps on the right, as you can see. Uh, so whichever they switch to, we will wait and see. Up the front we go. So leading away, the real Osman, uh, currently sitting in first first position. Uh, these two are this moment in time behind I think are helping each other out to try and close the gap up to the real Osman. Real Osman does not carry ballast. The two cars behind have got ballast. Uh, one of the cars behind is actually um one you know he's uh 107 percent so he's one of the heaviest uh, but kb is the heaviest that evening uh and i was struggling just to close it was all about the gearing but halfway through this race i was you know i got i got there in the end uh lee fitz in that sip in homes in seventh quick routed eighth uh, so gaps are appearing so clinical there in ninth position standing for samuel uh kb in 10 adam in 11 fat pickles bro Behind Adam now, so they'll be having their own little private battle. LS Dano recovering. Uh, well, he's not, he's not really recovering. He's struggling with that with that ballast. But let's see what he could do. Um, let's see what he could do. Heading to round number four uh, soon. Again, I'll be back in the commentary box for live action of that. I just wanted to experience the racing with an MVP, you know, all the boys on track, get on with them and see what we could do. Marshall in that 15th position, Falto just up the road from him in that 14th, so Marshall doing a good job so far, even though he's in last, long way to go, anything can happen. The real was on the racing medium, Ickle Pants breaking a bit of a gap now, it's him and TKM Spatters, but West is closing up slowly behind uh, TKM Spatters and I'm dropping back from West. Even though he's carrying a lot of weight, I just couldn't close the gap up to him. Uh, but anyway, uh, Lee Fitzy in sip. So he's quiet, he's on his own. I'm on my own. Crow Crowd as well is on his own. So Kinnacle's on his own. Ica Home as well. KB. KB just come out of the pits on the racing soft. Adam uh, coming under pressure now from Fat Pickles Road Dave. I just wish there was a button I could just press and just go in car rather than flicking through all the time. It is silly. So Fat Pickles Road Dave in that slipstream effect onto Adam. And will he get this position off of Adam? He's looking for it. He pulls to the right. Will he get this move done? Where is Dave gone? He's there. You can see the front of his car looking in the wing mirror. You can see him right behind now. So Adam protecting that 11 position from from Fat Pickles Road. LS Dano now dropping back a bit from from the lights of Fat Pickles Road. But he's got no one behind. So just concentrate if he can. And I know the weight's not helping him to get up to 12th for 11th, form a bit of a battle, let them slow up and then see if he can break on through. Valtteri, Marshall to the rear. The real Osman still leading away on lap number five. Sardegna is a fictional track, uh, but these two are coming into a massive battle now. Ickle Pants and TKM Spatters. West as well is closing that gap to him. Oh, TKM Spatters almost lost the rear end of that car by running it wide onto the grass, but he kept it nice and together. Break early for this corner. Uh, so with dirt on the tyres, you can end up sliding. Um, and yeah, and he's managed to keep that nice and steady, keep it nice and together. And yeah, so Wes is gained now by a couple of attempts there, to be honest with you. And he's in, uh, he's in that slipstream mode from uh, TKM Spatter. So have a look. He is indeed just over half a second. And I'm a further two seconds back from, from Wes. 
So here we are, West looking for it. These two battling is helping him. But ideally, they want to help each other out to try and close the gap up to, to the real Osman in first position. And yeah, Lee Fitzy as well. Lee Fitzy closing to me by a few ten. I didn't know it's at that night. Crograd, so clinical. Inga Holmes. So clinical standing for Samuel, remember. Inga Holmes, KB. Uh, now doing some stonking lap times. A 149.414. Uh, on lap number five, I think that is the fastest lap. It is indeed. So KB, the fastest car on track. Adam in 11. Fat pickles, bro. Adam into the gravel. That's going to enable LSNO to close up, and he is closing up. So with Adam, maybe breaking a bit late into that first corner, ran it a little bit deep into the gravel. But Dave is looking. See what I mean? Battling by you battling with each other. It helps the other driver behind close up, and this is what's happening. It's gifting LS Deno. It is really gifting LS Deno. He's on the racing medium, and we sit behind these two. Can he get his position done? Really tight to the apex there, really tight to the wall. Good exit as well there from LS Deno. And come back to the summit. Let's see what he could do. But we've got Dave, he's looking to the outside there of Adam will he get this move done he's looking for it we've got 19 minutes to go of the feature race Adam is still defends from Dave but this is gifting LS Deno still it may not seem like it but it is let's go out to the real Osman where's the real Osman so a lap with the real Osman on board now with the real Osman I apologize if I'm missing any moves so down to turn number one heavy breaker section he keeps it in second um, straight onto that power third up to third to fourth clip that kink there the left kink and we send that out a little bit wide um but let me be quiet let's just watch him in car So not too far to go to the end of this lap. That was a bit of a quiet lap on board there with the real Osman, a.k.a. Craig Thomas. First time uh, in the MVP race in BGWT. Uh, let's see how he goes throughout the season. Um, leading away at the minute. If he can get the win, if he carries on doing his performances early on in the race, and he, you know, he's up there, he can anytime soon carry that ballast but we'll wait and see what happens in the race uh, remember 30 minute 30 minute feature race anything can happen now we've got Bruce Osman in the pits Ickle Pants in second um, he's in the pits as well Lee Fitzy opting to stay out so he's going for a longer a longer stint on them racing medium he's in he's coming down the start finish rate anyone coming out we'll have a look in the wing mirror now no he's quite comfortable on his own so I think that was a little bit of a long pit stop you know uh, I did find that, so Tiki and Spadders and West. so Wes got in front of Tiki and Spadders, that's because Tiki and Spadders um, let West uh, go on through, I think it's in pit stops as well that actually happened, uh, so KB now jumped me, uh, I'm out of the stream. I didn't like the sit stream, especially coming down to turn number one, I felt I was out breaking myself a little bit, uh, so KB now trying to close the gap up to to Tiki and Spadders and West and Kenny that's the thing we'll wait and see I'm just still sitting behind KB there so uh, these two battling ahead uh, even though they're teammates they are actually helping each other uh, KB is get closing to them to be honest with you uh, and again he is closing 100% let's go down let's see what else is going on uh, here we are we've got a massive battle here we've got LSNO to the rear of these two uh, you can see his brother just up ahead, Adam. Uh, so, Ellis Deno looking to the inside there. Fat Pickles Road, does he get that move done? Um, he does not. So then, Adam still in that A. We've got Ellis Deno in that 10th. Crocad 
Um, he won't have no ballast, and maybe he can close up. We'll wait and see. Uh, yeah, and he's losing ground to Ellis Deno actually. So Ellis Deno, will he look to the inside here of Fat Pickles, bro? He does indeed. Oh, that was a cut. That was that was um. See, we we. I found we bad. I, I ran ballast last night in another league. Um, ESR BTCC. And I found with balance, you have to break a lot earlier than what you what you thought. And to me, this is what looked like what happened with LS Deno onto his brother. It wasn't intentional, nothing like that. God no, just LS Deno just got caught out under breaking. As you see here, he was trying to trying to stop it, but he couldn't. You know, and unfortunately, a bit of contact there with his um with Adam in that night position now. But LS Deno has got to recover now. He's got front end damage. He'd so have like a mechanic running around the front of the car, you know, on track with you going around invisible and repairing the front of that car. So Lee Fitz in the pits now that will quite possibly gift uh, the real Osman the lead of the race. So he will take the lead of the race again. Uh, Ickle Pants in third, KB in fourth. He's jumped the, the two teammates. By me watching out with Ellis, and I, unfortunately I did miss this. So I do apologize for that, but this is gonna probably carry on anyway to the end of the race. We've got KB the um, in third position now. He's actually side by side with uh, West heading into turn number one. Is he gonna have move done? He does indeed. So West now in that fourth position. KB up to up to third, the final podium spot. TKM Spadders as well is um trying to get a position onto his teammate. They're almost three wide heading into this turn. TKM Spadders looks down the inside of his teammate, does he? Does he get that move done, Chicken Spadders? He does not. Uh, but he's battling as well, you know. It's helping me because I, I, I noticed that night I was closing to him as well. Uh, then we've got um, Lee Fitzy on his own, trying to close the gap up to the back of me. With Dave in um, 8th, we've got Adam in 9th, we've got Crocrad in 10th, we've got Valto in 11th. So Valto trying to close up to the rear Crocrad in that in that 10th position but can he? We'll wait and see. No one behind him so he can just focus, concentrate, get back up there if he can. Uh, Inca Holmes, Marshall, so Inca Holmes and Marshall. Ellis Deno went into the pits, get on the racing soft, get rid of the, the, the racing hard on the racing medium so he's on the racing soft now. Can he make a good comeback for his final stint of the race? We'll wait and see. He's currently sitting in 15th. We'll keep an eye on Ellis Deno if he comes back up through the, the grid. So the real Osman retakes the lead. He has got a time gap over uh, Ickle Pants by 3.2 second gap. KB a further three second back. West and TKM Spadders almost in uh, KB's boot. I'm a further 1.6 back. Lee Fitzy further for two and so on and so on by the time gap there as you can see. So West in the pit. I was following these two around. I was like, yeah, whatever you do, boys, I'm going to do myself. So that's what I did do. Uh, so Ickle Pants in second now. Uh, KB in that third. Where he was anyway, Mark, weren't you? Yeah, yes. yeah he wasn't just there. you have been there for quite a while. Yeah, don't, don't ignore me, mate. My mind's everywhere at the minute. Uh, KB in that third. With Lee Fitzy in that fourth. We've got Crocodile up to fifth. Inga Holmes is the sixth. West is seventh. Marshall up to 7th now actually so Marshall up to 7th position um, still got a pit for another set of tyres I think uh, Wes in that 8th position his teammate behind in ninth. I'm in 10th uh, we've got Fat Pickles Road in 11th Adam in, in 12th Valtteri 13th LS Steno battling away with Valtteri so Valtteri coming under pressure now from LS Steno can LS Steno get this 13th position we'll wait and see on board now with LS Deno. He's looking to the inside there. Valtteri. Valtteri's got no ballast, no weight. So he's a lighter car than LS Deno. LS Deno's got to do more work in that car. But a nice exit there from that corner. We're to get this move done onto Valtteri. They're side by side. Head around this left hander now. Can LS Deno get this move done? Looks like he has. Will Valtteri come back at him? Same car now with Valtteri. Will Valtteri get his position off of LS Deno? We've got right about 11 minutes to go this race. Uh, hopefully the combining the two will work for me. If it does, I'll be well happy. Uh, so, can Valtteri get his position done off of LS Deno? Not just yet. The Rue Osmond's in the pits. 
come back to the same minute so clinical in that 15 position KB now promoted up to first with Will Osman and Ickle Pants pitting uh, Crow Cran, uh, Lee Fitzy Lee Fitzy in second he has, he's still got to do an extra pit stop uh, where does Will Osman come out in regards to the likes of the likes of TKM Spatters and West there's West so Will Osman's got a yeah he's he's done some stonking laps to have that much of a gap over over West coming out for his final stop so the real Osman up to third you see the gap there uh, TKM spatters Marshall I try and get back past Marshall now but can I that's the thing on board now with Marshall there I am my big head in that helmet and I'm trying to look past Marshall I look round uh, the inside there and Marshall I can't remember if I if I carried on with the move you know I did indeed so I got past Marshall there I think he left a bit of a gap anyway with that ballast it was affecting him at the front we go KB leading away on lap number 11 149 109 on lap number 6 Lee Fitzy in that second position got a bit of a gap now between him uh, and his cousin I think what are we looking at 6.5 between KB and Lee Fitzy and a further 11 between the real Osman and Lee Fitzy interesting really uh, he's going to lose that second anyway but it's all about KB will KB lose the lead of the race when he pits we'll wait and see or will he stay there who knows KB uh, not pitting yet the final 10 minutes of the race he's still not pitting he's opting to stay out a little bit longer Lee Fitzy in second position will Lee Fitzy go into the pits he does indeed for his final stop the real Osman in that third will be promoted up to second but you know first still hasn't pitted um, that's going to be quite fascinating Ickle Pants will be gifted up to up to well sorry will be moving up to third which he has indeed West up to fourth uh, TK and Spatters up to fifth whoever he is in sixth uh, Fat Pickles Road Dave coming down now it's going to be close between him and him and Lee Fitzy where's Fat Pickles Road he's coming over the timing line now there is Lee Fitzy just coming out the pit so yeah Lee Fitzy's got the job done on on Fat Pickles Road there but Fat Pickles Road uh, coming into heavy braking at turn number one has closed up massively actually to Lee Fitzy by Lee Fitzy coming out the pits why has Lee Fitzy come out on the racing soft racing soft so yeah uh, that's quite fascinating to be honest with you so Adam on the racing soft as well LS10 now up to 10 so he's doing a good recovery drive to be honest with you so he's in 10th position and can he catch ninth? That's the thing. So ninth, uh, 3.7 further up the road. Doable. Let's wait and see. Alistano, Val, Terry, Crocrad, Inca, Holmes, Marshall. So clinical in that 15th position. I don't know if he was carrying Samuel's ballast actually, or was he carrying his, or was he light? Does it work like that? So KB, when will he pit? We've got. Run right out seven minutes to go. And where would this gentleman pit? I don't know. Real Osman, how far are it back? 15 is touch and go. It's touch and go. Who's going to have the lead of the race? There's a Real Osman coming around that turn now to the right king. The fast right king. This is going to be close. KB still not at his pit stop. Real Osman coming around that fast right king. KB still not arrived. Remember, it's only tired. There's KB. The real Osman is there coming over the timing line. KB, oh, still not out the pit. So, real Osman retakes the lead of the race. What about Ickle Pants? There's KB coming out of the pits now. Uh, West there. We've got TKM Spatters with me behind. Um, I'm helping TKM Spatters try and get back up there. But TKM Spatters there down the inside of KB. Oh, this is close. Uh, and myself, let's go on board with TKM Spatters. So he's behind, and again he's a cheese in the in the bread. You know, he's a, he's in the middle of that sandwich. I'm looking to the inside to get inspired. I think better better of it. And yeah, will what's battling, battling, battling? Yeah, so four, fifth, and six battling away. Wow, it's getting close. Lee Fitzy could quite possibly capitalise from this and close up. But the real Osman leading away on lap number thirteen. Around about six minutes to go. Ickle Pants in second. Closing now. 
by the looks of it to the rear of the real Osman 3.6 second gap 1.9 between Mark and and Wes what can Mark do what can Wes do will Wes help Mark if Wes close up we'll wait and see because the real Osman is and again he's got a blue sector 148.821 is his fastest lap uh, KB and TKM Spad is bad anyway so KB uh, in that fourth he's been pressured out by TKM Spadders. TKM Spadders looking to get by um, I'm there as well we've got Lee Fitzy closing up do I look to the inside there of TKM Spadders? nope KB still defending from TKM Spadders. TKM Spadders wants this position off of KB maybe the slipstream will work let's go out car let's have a look TKM Spadders in fifth myself in that sit position let's go with uh TKM Spadders he's number we're free wide free wide heading down to turn number one I'm the lighter car so really I should come out on top of this situation and we're all three abreast heading to turn number one very nice clean race in there from all three of us uh hardly no contact whatsoever but these two are battling side by side and yes I'm gonna make history in a minute for myself because come around this corner left kink and we break to the right section and then I see KB a bit of a moment and I like yes Darren you're gonna go down the inside of KB and I overtake KB yes I overtook KB whippy wow that ain't gonna happen ever 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 again so yes I was loving it yeah I was like yeah I overtook Mr. Mr. X Factor yes well make success but yeah, I done it. I was I was very very impressed. A little Borat impression there. Uh, he's my favourite actor at this moment in time. Don't know why. Just love his expression. But there we are. KB down the inside. Did you get that move done? Oh, they're side by side with me. I think he does. We're still battling the way. I give him room, and he gives me room as well. Yeah, I was loving it this moment in time. I got to grips of the car by now. Uh, so yeah, uh, KB, TKM Spadders, but look who's closing up, Lee Fitzy is closing up to the rear of the three of us. So yeah, he's uh, he's gaining from this to be honest with you. Uh, what have we got, run up 3 minutes 20 seconds to go. Quick rundown shall we? The Will Osmond leading the way, lap number 15 from Ickelpants in 2nd, from West in 3rd, TKM Spadders in that 4th. Myself in fifth, KB in sixth, Lee Fitzy in seventh, Fat Biggles Row in eighth, Adam in ninth, Lee in tenth, uh, still in that tenth, Valtteri in eleventh, Inca Holmes in twelfth, Crowground in thirteenth, but Crowground is pressuring the rear of Inca Holmes. Uh, not too long to go now, unless they make two laps. Oh, very late breaking there from Crowground, but it kept it together. Marshall in fourteenth, and so Kinnacle in that 15 position round number round number round number three race number six Sunday will be uh, round number four I will be live for that race or that evening sorry again I'll be live from 10 to 9 so check me out then uh, but yeah fantastic round of night of racing to be honest with you single pants west yeah gaps are appearing now apart from uh, myself and TKM Spadders. I thought about it. I knew I was lighter than, than TKM Spadders, but I didn't want to come into no incident with them. You know, it's, I'm stepping in. I was covering Pilo, and I didn't want no one to war to happen. Um, so I kept it nice and clean, you know, because maybe in the future I'll come back and do another one off. I did enjoy it. Uh, so, Lee Fitzy got past KB, but KB's looking for that position back off of Lee Fitzy. Uh, just buying this time. We're going on to the final lap in a minute. The real Osman is heading now down two, which will be the final lap. Let's go back to that battle. There's a moment in time. KB in uh, the rear slipstream of Lee Fitzy, and he can actually see fifth and four. So you know he's um in attack mode now. I pull to the outside of TKM Spatters. And kind of get his position off of TKM Spatters. I think I did. Yeah, I, I think I did. Yeah, I think I did. Uh, but where is coming to effect now? 
Yeah, mine are more worn than the likes of TKM Spada, Lee Fitzy, KB. We're all battling for that fourth position. Who will come out on top? Who will grab that fourth position? Uh, TKM Spadders, KB down the inside there of Lee Fitzy. They're battling side by side now. See what else is going on. Nothing else going on this moment in time. Uh, let's go back to KB and Lee Fitzy. Lee Fitzy still defending from KB, and I'm still defending from from um, TKM Spadders. So let's go like this. So let's go back. We can see uh, from TKM Spadders' point of view, Lee Fitzy and KB battling it out. I will go up to the front in a minute to see who gets the winner of the race. But TKM Spadders looking. He jinks it, he jinks it, he does it. Does he do it? He does indeed. But Lee Fitzy, a bit of a moment now with Lee Fitzy. What happened with Lee Fitzy? Let's go in car. Oh, it's coming with Lee Fitzy. Did he get his braking all wrong, maybe? Oh, yes, he got his braking all wrong. Oh, he just avoided me. And yeah, uh, unfortunate that. Now he's fallen back down. But KB, I think he went for the move on me. I can't quite remember. Yeah, I ran it a bit wide. I ran it wide there. I had dirty tyres and I did lose it. But at the front we go. The real Osman. Uh, first win of the season. Will there be more to come? So the real Osman takes the win of the race in first. Then we got Ickle Pants in that second position. With Wes in third. TKM Spadders now coming down in that fourth position. Just off of KB. TKM Spadders in fourth. KB in 5th, myself in 6th, Lee Fitzy in 7th, Fat Pickles in 8th, what's going on here? Adam in 9th, Ellis Dano in 10th, Crow Crowd in 12th, Inca Holmes in 13th, Marshall will be 14th, and then to the rear will be so clinical in 15th position. Uh, let's see what the real Osman could do the rest of the season. Can he get more wins? Please tune in. This Sunday for round number four live on Idol 4 Gaming, my YouTube channel. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. It does help me and it helps MVP. Apart from that, I see you again soon. March 14th, so can it go in 15th. That's it. See you soon. Thank you. Bye bye.